Okay, question eight. Uh, given the limits of four uh, x plus two as x approaches three, uh, determines the existence of the limits uh, limits of the f x. And uh, here, uh, first step, uh, find the right hand limits of the function. So you have to check the limits from the both side of the x equals to three. Okay. So um, so uh, first step, find the right hand limits of the function limits as x approaches a from the right of the fx. Uh, so this signs mean uh, positive. Uh, uh, this positive signs means uh, this limit from the right of the function. So write down the limits. Uh, limit as x approaches 3 of uh, 4x plus 2 and uh, substitute 3 here into the function. So 4 times 3 plus 2 and right hand limits here as is and uh, equals to the 14. Yeah. And step 2, uh, find the left hand limit of the function and uh, write down the left hand limit, limit as x here approaches 3 and uh, from the left of the function uh, for x plus 2 and using the substitution method so 4 times 3 plus 2 and the left hand limit of the function here equals to the 14 yeah okay and step 3 Okay, step three, so you compare the left hand limits of the function uh, compared with the right hand limit of the function. Okay, so the left hand limit of this function as is and uh, equals to the 14 and the right hand limit of the function here uh, equals to the positive uh, 14. Yeah, uh, so limit approaches the same value from the both side of the function and conclusion you hear uh, limit of the function, limit of the x approaches 3 of the 4x plus 2 exists and uh, equals to the 14. Okay, settle. Okay. And the second method using the graphical method. Okay, so using the graphical method, uh, so given the function here, fx uh, equals to the 4x uh, plus 2. Okay, uh, so before you sketch the graph of the linear function, first you find the intercepts of the uh, function here. So find the y-intercepts. Okay, so find the y-intercept of the function uh, x here equal to 0 and the y here equals 2 and the y-intercept here at the 0, 2 and the x-intercept y, y equal to 0 and the find the value of x so the x-intercept here exists at the uh, negative uh, 2, 0, yeah? And uh, draw the graph of the uh, linear function so you sketch the graph here Okay, so the y-intercepts at the 0, 2 here and the x-intercept here at the negative uh, 2, 0 yeah. So you draw the straight line, okay. And here the x-intercept negative 2 and the y-intercept here y equals uh, 2, yeah. And the limits uh, x approaches 3 of uh, 4x plus 2. 
Okay, so you look at the way this value x here equals to three, uh, and substitute into the function. Uh, so answer u here equals to the uh, fourteen. Okay, so using the graphical method, you can check from the both side of the x equals to 3. Okay, so here from the right hand side of the function, and here from the left hand side of the uh, x equals to 3. Yeah, uh, so from the right of the function, uh, you can check this arrow uh, from the right of the function. Maybe we can start from the x here equals to the 5. Uh, 4, 3.1, 3.01, 3.001, yeah, and you check the y values on the y axis, uh, so the y values here equals to the 14, yeah, so you can, so you can write down here, the right hand limits of the function uh, equals to the 14. Okay, and uh, from the left of the function, from the left of 3, uh, so maybe you can start from the negative 2, start from here, negative 2, uh, negative 1, x equal to 0, 1, 1.9, 1.9, 1.999, yeah, and this value, the y values here, uh, equals to the 14. So the left hand limits uh, here equals to the 14. Okay. So the limits here approaching the same value from the both side of the function. Uh, from the left here uh, equals to the 14. And from the right of the function here equals to the 14. Okay. So conclusion you here uh, limits uh, as x here approaches 3 of uh, 4x plus 2 as this and uh, equals to the 14.